This is one, I used the Yankees in 2009. Um, something could be said for the Cubs, I think, this year also, but I, I really feel that this was one of the, the first times I've, I've heard a major league team talk about it. And the Yankees in 09, all they talked about was passing the baton, and that was the, their biggest deal. And, and you're talking about a team with superstars. You know, uh, everybody. We all know who they are, the Jeters, the, the Bernie Williams, the Posada. They, all they talked about was passing the baton. Um, Begins with a balanced lineup of hitters committed to the following, grinding out of bats and executing your offensive situation. You know, that's, there again, there's no swing involved. It's about grinding out of bats, you know, having a game plan for your offense. Idea that no one hitter has to carry the entire team. And that's hard on a lot of teams. You know, you have one or two guys that are your guys, but I think we got to try to make them aware that they don't, if they don't have to do everything. Refusing to be the third out of the inning, such a big deal. As I stated earlier, there's so many times during when you got two outs, and we've all done it. I did it too, quite a bit. Is okay, gosh, you just can't wait to get the the third out. We'll get, start hitting, and there you go. It's your five hitters later, and you're going to the mound, calling for another guy. Um, you know, ha talk to your players about taking it personal. Don't be that third out. Take it personal, and that starts in practice. Um, you know, we do, a, we do a drill where the machine's really close and you strike out, there's a consequence. Or you don't get the skill done, there's a consequence. There's always some sort of consequence, so they refuse to be the third out of an inning.